Hi guys, and welcome to my Let's Play of Alien Isolation. Now this game, well, it really does bring back a lot of memories for me. Because I remember the first movie when it first came out. I was a kid at the time, and of course, way too young to watch this movie. I was not allowed to watch it, but I really did want to. I've always been a sci-fi fantasy nerd, and I really did want to watch this film. Because it was a sci-fi film. And, you know, everyone had said, oh, it's really scary, but I thought, I don't care. Sci-fi. Want to watch it. Of course, as a kid, I was not allowed to watch movies like this, and in fact, it came on quite late at night, I think 10.30 at night or something. It was way after my bedtime. But... Luckily for me, I actually had an old black and white TV in my room. I was one of the few kids to actually have that. I got it for, as a birthday present. It was a second-hand, well, it was a gift. It was a birthday present from, from my mother, and she would got it from one of her friends who was upgrading to a new color TV. And so I got this second-hand black and white thing, tiny, tiny. You, you wouldn't even use it on a computer now, how small it was. It was, I, I can't remember the size. Um, the frame was falling apart. Yeah, I think it had been dropped at some point and the frame was all cracked. And it was held together with tape, uh, but it worked. And uh, I had it in my bedroom. And so I was watching Alien, the original movie. Okay, what's going on? Don't do this. What are you doing? Don't do this. Okay, no cutscenes, no cutscenes. Don't ruin it. Don't ruin it. So I was, um, I was sat watching this, this movie in my room in the dark because, of course, I couldn't let anybody know that I was watching this. So I had all the lights off. And of I couldn't have the sound loud, so I had to sit literally right in front of the TV, closer than I am to my computer monitor now, with the sound really, really low. And I watched this movie in my bedroom, and I got about a quarter of the way through before I switched it off. <laughs> it was terrifying, really terrifying for, for, for a kid of that age. I was absolutely just, couldn't believe it, so turned it off. And I actually didn't watch the movie again until I was, I think I was 18. And Aliens, the second movie, came out and I really wanted to see that, so I revisited Alien. And I thought, well, I'm an adult now, it, it, should, it shouldn't be that bad, it shouldn't be, shouldn't be too scary. And I, I watched the whole thing, but oh my god, was I wrong about it not being scary. It really was terrifying. And it, in a way that a lot of movies just don't manage to get. Uh, perhaps it was just the way it was filmed. I, I'm not totally sure, but something about Alien, the first movie, is old school scary. Just terrifying to its core. Quite brilliant. I think a lot of it is due to the sort of innate helplessness of the, of the, the people. They really had no way of fighting back against this creature. They were truly... I mean, it wasn't a fight or flight situation. It was a flight situation the whole time. Just run away, run away, run away. That was your option. Run away. And it made it so much scarier than the second movie, where, where they could actually fight back. So, yeah. I remember that movie and I remember it well. And still consider it one of the best horror movies of all time. So of course, I am looking forward to this game. But to do the game justice, of course, I have turned all the lights off in my room, I have closed the curtains, and I'm sat here in the dark. And I'm going to play the entire thing in the dark, as I did as a small child watching that tiny black and white TV. I'm going to try and recapture that sense of abject terror. Uh, now, for those of you who have never watched any of my Let's Plays, especially my horror Let's Plays, I am absolutely looking forward 
to being terrified. I am not going to resist it. I am not going to pretend it's a game. I'm not going to, you know, remember that I can reload. I am going to be playing this like I am there, and I am going to allow myself to be utterly petrified. <laughs> I will probably be going a lot slower than many of you are happy with on the grounds of I don't want to die. Um, occasional moments of sprinting and running will probably occur, but they will also be accompanied with crying and screaming. So be warned, this, this may be a pitiful display <laughs> of terror. Um, so there you go. I will not be trying to make it amusing or funny. I will not be role-playing. I will be immersing myself. I will be allowing myself to become the main character. Uh, but I will not be trying to be anything other than myself in a completely terrified state. So, there you go. Um, I would also like to say a big thank you to Unforbiddable, uh, who bought me this game and sent it to me as a gift. He did so literally as I was looking at the page, considering whether I should buy it and play it now or wait a little while. Um, and I suddenly got the message that I had received this gift. And so, obviously, big thank you to him. And I uh, hope I do the game justice. And with that, I will uh, end this video and start playing. Feel free to join me if you want to join in the terror.